Meow and welcome to Panthe Place Morrowind. I'm Nighty, the Black Panther Kitty, and I'll be the host for this episode. And before we actually start exploring this place, exploring this, these, these ruins of Pathuminal that we just found in the Balmora sewers after these people who have despawned now um, have attacked us, I'm going to say if you have something to drink, take a sip now. And if you don't, then pause this video and fetch something. Because hydration is important and I have not drunk since last time. Well, I've done. It's not been a week. Of course, I'm recording these episodes back to back, but still, I'm thirsty now, so cheers. And now, freshly hydrated, let's head into the ruins. Let me do a little quick save. There's some one, I guess. Yeah, there's a person. Let's see, they are trying to paralyze me from afar. That was the wrong magic. Let's try that again. Okay, so they're, they're all... It seems like they're all wearing the same clothing. There is this, this belt and this amulet. It, it looks like they're all wearing the same. It looks like some kind of cult to me. Okay, sadly, this is not something I can collect. Ladiaya Flexus. They're all wearing the same common robe, the same common shirt. This one had a bread. Let's stick to the right-hand side walls. There is... You can look through this. There's, this does not seem like a door. But we can look through here and we see what looks like... Appears to be a bedroom of sorts. Let's check. Okay, this must be... A mix of Daedric Ruin and... No, I think this is Daedric Ruin. Dwarven, not Daedric. That's what I want. Dwemer. There was a voice. Well, let's take a look at this image. We see here an arc, and we see here two figures. And a third, and they're fighting, I guess? Well, anyway. Let's continue. So that they're emptying out their medica. Okay, the, aha, so that's their tactic. They're paralyzing me. And then see, this is now, this is not a problem because this is not, um, this is, this is a permanent damage to strength. So now that he dies, of course, this fiend, oh, it's a permanent damage to strength and endurance and of course we don't have any restoration let us see if we can real quick make something but i'm sure that we won't because we only have four four things no so yes that's um that's not good i'm actually going to load which means we have to we have to kill the first enemy so again Save after every enemy encounter. Damn it. Yep. Empty your magic out here. So now she don't, doesn't have any magic anymore. Oh, now she only has... Now she only has the dagger, is what I wanted to say. So that's actually a pretty good way of dealing with them. So, safe. Do I have something like reflect? Reflect 20%, yeah, but that's for five seconds. Yep, 
He's lots of magic, yeah. But now he's out. And again, he's trying to heal himself, but this time, since I'm not paralyzed, I can just... Oh, he has lots of stuff. Well, basically, just lots of, lots of things. But... Now I'm over-encumbered again, but this time it's not because my stuff has been damaged. Oh, that's interesting. That's a different glass dagger, isn't it? No, it's not. Eurasanian, Eurasanian glass dagger. Which is weaker regarding the enemy, uh, the enemy, the the damage. It also has less condition. I think these pauldrons, yes, they also have less armor, light, armor rating here, but they're also less heavy, so better than wearing nothing in that respective slot. So I'm going to just give him. I'm going to give him back the robes, so now he's wearing robe again. And then I'm just going to mark, use the amulet of um, CV intervention. And then we check out what we can sell. First of all, since we did get some ingredients, I'm going to... You know what, since we have money and I'm... I mean, I'm interested in gaining more money because I want to buy stuff, expensive stuff. But um, I'm going to check if we can train alchemy higher first. So I'm going to go to the alchemist, who's now a good friend of ours. And I'm going to buy lots of ingredients. Which is super expensive. Ooh, no, 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 that was too far. You know what, I'm going to, no, I'm going to do this, I'm just going to do this. Okay, what, what is the, uh, we have Master's Retort. It's the highest thing. Let's try to get a little discount. Yes, this worked. Okay, so now we are going to do some more alchemy. So first of all, we are interested in especially restoring Magicka. And we have these two. And we're going to add a 45 Magicka on top of that too. Hmm. Okay, so this does not work. It did work. What happens if I... Okay, that's interesting. It did work with other ingre ingredients, though. Maybe it's just the negative effects that get added? At least two ingredients are needed to be added. So, but we did get a level in alchemy. That's interesting. That's the most important part. Restore health is also important. And now we're just going to use fatigue. Oh, and restore attribute luck. That's interesting. Okay. And we're going to go, well, that's a restore fatigue. Restore attribute. Strength would be interesting. Sadly, it's not there. Um, fortify health and magic is not interesting. Without the absorb would be more interesting than drain, but um, I mean, we can't absorb our own, our own Things, Q, 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 blah, 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 detect enchantment, detect key. These could be interesting spells, though. I'm just going from top to bottom. Cure blight disease, common disease. I mean, I could just go and check which is the best combination that I can do. Let's put here a bigger number, so we just need to click once. As soon as we have things in there, detect key. I mean, this was now, this was of course very, very uh, resource heavy. We used up a lot of resources there. 
that are super expensive Intelligence, yes, luck is the next one. Uh, that was super expensive. But as I said, I'm now focused on learning. Now we're actually, we got to level up. Uh, personality, speed. Strength. Willpower. And there we go, fatigue. Draining fatigue of others also is interesting, but we can't, we can only do it to ourselves, which is drain health. I'm not going to drink the drain health potion, but I'm going to learn, I'm not going to learn doing it. I'm going to learn alchemy by doing it. That's what I wanted to say. And another alchemy up. And health is what we did, then feather. Yes, I know this is a bit exhausting. And I'm interested in whether this will actually, I mean, we were using up our burning ingredients by, by failing to do stuff. We also have lots of ingredients that we cannot use. Oh, this is now a reset here. Agility. Fortify Magicka is what we can't do. Lightning Shield. Paralyze. And then the resistances. I think now we're, yeah, basically spell absorption and water walking. Okay. So now we have lots of potions here that we can sell. So starting with a cure common disease, we don't want to be able to cure poison. We don't want to need to drain attributes. Drain fatigue, all the drain things are not interested. interesting. Restore attribute also is not interesting. That was Restore Fatigue. Let us see. This is 0.1. This is what we want to keep because it's super light. So it's 1, 3, 4, 5 Restore Fatigues. Restore Health we're going to keep. No side effects. No side effects. Restore Magicka. Restore Health. Restore Magicka. No, we're just selling back the ingredients. And she also has more ingredients now. This is interesting. I'm pretty sure we bought all of them. Um, but I think we only lost a little bit of money, honestly, because it was like, I think 2800 or something that we paid into the so we lost 700 and gained experience. Um, I think two or three points of experience, which I don't think we would have gotten for 700. But maybe I'm also just just calculating in a way that we that we're better than we are. Um, but honestly, I don't care because we have we've done the alchemy thing. Set forty seven and fifty is where we want to go. So now we can just head over to the weapons trader. Do we have no we don't have any well those those are pretty uh, pretty low ranked weapons even though they're glass their value is only 150 so they and they're weaker than the regular ones say what you want or go away but you're just being in the way nothing more nothing less so let's see here Yeah, let's let's do this. Same thing we did earlier, only we fewer things to do it with. So I'm just going to not spare you the action. I don't think we need so many daggers. Also, as I said, these are not that valuable. And 
I think that was actually it. So now we can go to our friend who buys everything. Say what you want or go away. Let me check the clothing store. I think there is a clothing store here, isn't there? Yes, Outfitter. Just to see how much gold they have. 800, which is more than um, our friend has. The items are pretty worthless, but I can use it to sell him stuff. He also buys and sells nearly everything, which is also interesting. So if we have him as a friend too, it means we can just sell our stuff here because he has more gold. So we have two person, people who we can sell stuff to without having to wait for days to just sell stuff. Yeah, that's nice. So this is why I'm going to do this here now to this year now to yes this 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 sounds like it makes sense in English. So it's when I look out the window, the, the little cellar window, it's dark out. Even though it's not that late. I don't like winter for that. I don't like it when it gets dark very early because uh, it always makes me sleepy because my, my body says it is night now it's dark out so go to bed I think that was the last item yes nice so we can so we should try making more friends than just than just Ravir. Ravir is basically the most worthless trader as it seems and I've always just traded with him. It's, it's kind of tradition for me, and now I'm, I'm, I'm switching. I'm switching the way that I play. It's also interesting. I still don't like her, though. She tr tried to have me kill people who were not necromancers. Welcome. Care to talk? And there we go. We can increase our intelligence, which is awesome because it's uh, our our magica. And I think it's just intelligence, right? Yes. So we now increase our magica and intelligence increases by four, which is awesome. Magic resistance is nice. And then we have agility or speed. It determines how fast you can move, which is good because it also means how fast we walk. And this is the maximum fatigue. Let me do speed because it means we can walk faster. I don't think that much, but we can walk faster. Oh, um, I think I guess I did not press until healed. There we have it. And now we. I always forget this. I can do a recall. I'm going to try. Greetings and salutations. Greetings and salutations to you. I'm going to try to use the the shining ring. Does enchantment turn to do mark on self? Yes. So this costs zero. Yes, one of, this of course is a way too big. So I we should. Oh, this is see. This is super expensive. We should try trapping weak souls in our weak soul gems, so we can try enchanting things ourselves to increase our enchantment skill. I think that's that's an awesome thing to do. But we need to remember doing this. So let's let us see this. It's not what it is. There's stairs in the floor. Okay. Can I? Okay. He, this is yeah, this is burden. Let's try soul trapping him. Am I good or what? Yes, you're good. That surprised me. This is why I let him kill me because. Uh, 
Okay, he does burden us and then he walks away. So we need spells that are hitting him from afar. So I'm going to first soul trap him and then I'm going to shoot at him. Soul trap, because this I can do on touch. And his first spell actually is also on touch. I have the other. This should have hit him, I hope it did. And now we use this. And now we need to quickly heal. Yes, that was good, but we did not get a soul, sadly. Can we? We can't rest because enemies in. Damn it, he, he saw us. Okay, I think he does the exact same, which is bad because I did not save. Um, Yeah, he burns us and now he shoots at us. Okay, so let's see. Um, we want to, let's first restore health and then restore America. Now let's see if I can. First reflect. Just Medica. <laughs> then let's do it that way. If the first one doesn't work, let's head back. It says enemies are nearby. Maybe we can actually rest in here. Um, although it doesn't, it's not necessary anymore. Oh, I actually forgot to do them. No, that's that's the one that we put the shirts on. Okay, I'm going to save. And we're going to check. I'm going to keep. So we should not try this with uh, with the people in here. We should try this with with some creatures. Should have tried it with the uh, with the rats. Okay. Good. Now let's see, I'm dropping quick saves all over the place. Okay, there's something. This did not sound like a regular enemy. But they... Yeah, this is one of these. Ah, fellow Khajiit, why are you so, so angry? I'm Khajiit too. Yes, I'm standing here. Oh, that hit. I think it was... That's Sabi. Scroll of healing. Sc open scroll of Enduzi's unhinging. And now we're over encumbered. Well, then that's... Let's redress that. Oh, no, that's that's... That's too much. What is the... Sadly, we cannot sort by weight or something. Uh, wait, eight. Just going to give them something. Um, I'm... I'm being stupid right now. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to find something that's heavy. Failing to cast Mark is uh, embarrassing. That's the word I was looking for. Okay, let's see. Let's let's see. We have things and stuff. Let's restore fatigue. Well, we can do some potions. This is a good area to train. Um, so this 
Also restore fatigue. That's that's a good area to train alchemy actually. Okay, so there is this alchemy. So we're this alchemy woman is what I want to say. Um, so we're going to go up here and sell our ingredients and potions to the fine alchemist because she has lots of money. Yes, yes. So we have grief. Restore fatigue is okay. Lots of these because we made new ones, so these are these are even stronger. Yep. And there goes the salt rice. Go Goodbye. How do you And also, if we want to buy, I mean, we did buy ingredients from her already. If we want to buy ingredients, it's way cheaper now than it was before, since we made a friend. Now, the next thing would be clothing. Heading to the clothing shop. So I've read on, on I think it was Reddit, that many people actually kill Ravir and use his home as home. Which would be completely against my thinking, to be honest. Because we, we Kashyyyk must stick together. I mean, there, as you can see, there are Kashyyyk. It's, it's, I think the official Kashyyyk lore is that Kashyyyk do not stick together that well. They would betray each other at the first opportunity. Um, but I personally think that us catfolk should stick together in this world. There. See how fast we're making friends. It is super fast. I see I stand. In good company, yes, you do. No, let's see. That we increase his disposition too. And then we can sell even better there. And now we're going to go to the beer and sell the petty stuff. You talk too much out there. I know what I also have people listening, you know, that's why I talk so much. So we, for example, we have torches. I think I always forgot selling the torches. Um, I think that's actually it. But yeah, we get 66 gold just for the torches, which is also pretty nice. Okay. I think how much how much do these weigh? Well, not much, but I'm just thinking these lock picks. I mean, we, we, we do have a magical way to opening doors. On the other hand, um, increasing the security skill does not hurt, does it? I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. So we're going to head downstairs, basically flying because we can jump so far. And again, I pressed the wrong button, and there we go. Just recall. And now we take everything back. Little quick save. And let's see what else is here. Who else? This, so these are dwarven ruins that are caved in, as it seems. So this is an entrance to the actual ruins. Okay, 
Okay, she's str a bit stronger, a bit more resilient. But that's good because this teaches us destruction, which we need to level up to level 80. No, I'm not even trying. I'm just leveling up destruction, honestly. Okay, so there's noises coming from this room, so I need to save them. There might be some machines that can attack us. I don't see anything dangerous here. Oh no, there is... Seems like a generator and some books and stuff. Yeah, there's, there's just machines. He's half transparent. I don't know what this means. Um, still magical potion. I'm trying using this the guild issued potions first. Now this ghost will disappear. But we and and the curse is only temporary. Awesome songs. So we have these nice items. This also is just like could be an oven from behind, and this is the chimney. I'm sure. This is nicely done, honestly. I like I like these. I like the dwarven ruins anyway. So this is very nicely done. Let's have a little sip of something. And before we head in deeper, let's just take a break here. And let's continue next week. So we'll see each other on next Morrowind Monday. Bye-bye.